Hello, Hawk here again. I wanted to make a quick video on everything to do with worker mining. Specifically, this one is more related to Zerg. Part of the reason for that is mining efficiency matters the most for Zerg because they have the fewest workers per patch. And that means that being efficient about your mining is pretty important. So let's uh, start from one of the beginnings, which is going to be boosting. Now, obviously you wanna start from the close minerals as much as you can, but specifically um, there is a trick in the game called boosting. And on these types of patches, you just hit the return cargo option which is C or appears here when they have the minerals. And on this type of patch, you click it when the drone is about here. On these types of patch, they either automatically boost or you hit it right after they get their cargo. And it'll do that. Next thing. Drones should deposit to the corner of the hatchery. And this is a good example of how much quicker they deposit compared to here, where these drones are depositing to the middle of the hatchery. So I've been having these two drones go for a while and they started at the same time, but we see these two drones both have mined out 260 left on minerals. Whereas on this one, where they're depositing to the corners of the hatchery, it has 108 and 220 respectively. And 240. So it's much faster to deposit to the corners of the hatchery. So the way you can set that up is twofold. Um, sorry, one more to show you before I show how to set that up. Um, this straight line is also better than having the drone go like this. So 484 compared to 412. And I'll set this one up, but it's similar for, for all drones. You can either, once they have a um, mineral, just have it deposit on the corner and it'll automatically set it up, or you can simply uh, just click on the mineral from the right position. So similarly for these, what you can do to set it up is either do like that, or you can set it up like this, and that'll fix the mining. Okay. A little bit of basic stuff is when you right click a mineral patch, um, drones move through other enemy units. So for example, if you have links here blocking, this is more of a basic thing, but it's called mineral walking, your drones will just uh, float past them basically. And if you select for them to move when they're on in this stacked state where they're just kind of gliding over stuff, they will kind of push other units out of the way. They're really good uh, for attacking and defense. Last thing is geysers. If you were to try and mine from a geyser too early and you right click it, drones will just go to the geyser and nothing happens. However, there's a command called gather the use for this is similar to the last one. It's not done, but if you use gather and click, as long as it finishes before the drones actually get there, the drones will continue to mine. Okay. So one of the last things. So let's say you get attacked. Let's say you have a lot of drones mining, All right? And you get attacked and suddenly you start to see that uh, some of your drones are no longer mining. Instead of having to individually click on these drones and do like da, 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 and send them over to mine, what you can do instead is simply just box everything and hold shift and right click. And you see how even though there were drones that were already mining, selected in that group, they do not um, 
get bothered by that command. And this is really nice because you don't want, let's say you do it just right click. Well, these drones were already mining and now they they just got interrupted, which is kind of annoying, right? You don't want to interrupt drones already mining. So if you just, but you can just do that and then hold shift and right click. And it'll only select, it'll only tell the drones that aren't mining to, to go and do stuff. Uh, I think that's about it. Uh, basically, try and deposit on the corners of the hatchery. Try and deposit in a straight line. So like the fastest way to mine this patch would be from here. The fastest way on that patch would be from there. Similarly, for this position, what you would want to do is set it up so that it would be something like this, where you get straight lines into as close to the corner as you can get it. And I think that's everything. Uh, when you make a gas, you can use the gather command and drones, as long as the gas finishes by the time the drone reaches the geyser, they'll automatically start mining from it. Use return cargo to boost certain patches. The most common one are is this one, where you just press C and it will automatically boost, or on this one, where it's manually boosted. That's it.